Hi, I'm Jeff at LateModelRestoration.com. Today I'm here with Jonathan. Jeff, thanks for having me, man. Yeah, no problem. We're here to talk to you today about Calvin grills and lower windshield moldings for your Fox Mustang. Before we get on to this install, Jonathan, tell them a little bit more about these parts. Will do. Our Calvin grill and lower windshield molding kit is the best on the market. The Calvin grill is an exact reproduction of the original and is a direct replacement for 1983 to 93 Fox Mustang. The lower windshield molding comes out of the Ford original tooling, even has the Ford original part number and Ford oval stamped into the back. Hey, I noticed you also brought a hardware kit. Tell them a little bit more about that. We highly recommend picking up one of our Cal Grill hardware kits whenever doing this install. It comes with the six screws and four plastic inserts for the cow panel. That way you get rid of all the rusted and broken hardware that's probably on your car right now. Well, hey, Jonathan, I appreciate it. Let's get this install started. Let's do it. To remove the cow vent grill, the first step is to remove the windshield wiper blades. As you can see, Jonathan has marked their position with some blue painter's tape. This ensures they go back in the correct position. Now, Jonathan, walk them through removing the actual cow vent grill. It's really simple, Jeff. You just have six screws that hold the cow vent grill to the cow panel itself. Once you get those removed out of the way, you can pop it up and you have your windshield washer nozzle hose and then you can remove the actual windshield washer nozzle and transfer it to your new cow grill. This is one of the main reasons we're replacing this because they're broke. The other two problems that you typically find are fading and chipping. Let's go ahead and get this thing off, Jeff. All right. All right, Jonathan, looks like you've got that cow vent off. The next step is going to be remove the lower windshield moldings. Now, Jonathan, these look like they're held on by the side molding. Is this the tool you need to remove those? That is the correct tool. This is a windshield reveal molding tool. These side moldings are held to the body with three to four spring-loaded clips per side to remove them. All you do is lift up slightly on your molding and slide the hook of the tool until you find the clip. Then engage the clip and pull out and you can hear how that popped up. You'll just repeat that three to four times. If you don't have one of these tools, you can grab one right off of our website and we keep them in stock. And once you get that molding loose, it'll kind of just break free like that. And as you can see, one of the tabs that retain this lower molding is already broken off. Yours will probably be the same way, and if not, it may be by the time you get done. Basically, you'll want to start by removing this front side just by pulling up, and then it comes loose. The broken tab, you can just grab you some needle nose pliers, pull that broken piece out, and you're good to go. To install your new lower windshield molding, engage the tab on the lower windshield molding with the side molding, and simply snap the side molding into place, and then finish up by engaging the two tabs on your lower molding. Jeff, can you grab the new cow grill? Sure thing, Jonathan. Now, before I go ahead and install this, looks like we're missing a tab over there. Yeah, the, uh, the insert is missing on this car. Installation is really simple. They just snap into place. If you're missing some of your cowl inserts, along with uh, any broken ones, just fold up the tabs, shove them through, snap your new ones in place, really simple. Now, when we're putting this in, you definitely don't want to forget to hook up your windshield washer nozzle hose. All right, I can already tell a big difference compared to that faded old broken one that we had before. Yeah, it's amazing what just a couple of parts will do to the outside of a vehicle. The last step to finishing up this project is to install the windshield wiper blades. For more install videos and tech tips, check out latemodelrestoration.com.